टेन स्टैंडर्ड सोशल साइंस प्रिपरेटरी एग्जाम की आंसर फोर चॉइसेस आर गिवन फॉर ईच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग क्वेश्चंस आर इनकम्प्लीट स्टेटमेंट्स ओनली वन ऑफ देम इज करेक्ट और द मोस्ट अप्रोप्रिएट चूज द करेक्ट आंसर एंड राइट द कंप्लीट आंसर अलॉन्ग विद इट्स लेटर ऑफ द अल्फाबेट मेजर ट्रेडिंग सेंटर ऑफ फ्रेंच इन इंडिया वॉस सूरत कोचिन पाण्डिचेरी मुंबई करेक्ट आंसर इज पाण्डिचेरी विशाल मैसूर स्टेट केम इन टू एक्सिस्टेंस इन 1949-1950-1952-1956 करेक्ट आंसर इज 1956 The fundamental rights are discussed in the Constitution of India from Articles 12 to 35, 46 to 49, 57 to 66, 77 to 89. Correct answer is 12 to 35. Movement opposing Kaiga nuclear power plant in Karnataka was led by Medha Patkar, Shuram Karanth, Prof. M. D. Nanjunda Swami. कुसुमा स्वरप करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी शिवराम कारंत द वर्क ऑफ प्लेटो इज डिविजन ऑफ लेबर पॉलिटिक्स द रिपब्लिक फूट लूजर्स करेक्ट आंसर इज द रिपब्लिक द नेशनल पार्क ऑफ उत्तराखंड इज कॉर्बेट सरिस्का गिर दुद्वा करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए कॉर्बेट Economic development is an improvement in economic welfare said by Professor Meir and Baldwin Professor Colin Clark Mahmoob ul Haq Mehboob ul Haq Amartya Sen Correct answer is option B Professor Colin Clark March 15 is famous as World Women's Day World Literacy Day World Consumers Day World Health Day करेक्ट आंसर ऑप्शन सी वर्ल्ड कंज्यूमर स्टे सेकेंड मेन आंसर द फॉलोइंग क्वेश्चन इन ए सेंटेंस ईच हू इम्प्लीमेंटेड द पॉलिसी ऑफ सब्सिडरी अलायंस लॉर्ड वेलेस्टली इम्प्लीमेंटेड द पॉलिसी ऑफ सब्सिडरी अलायंस विच ट्रीटी एंडेड द थर्ड आंग्लो मैसूर वार श्रीरंगपटन ट्रीटी एंडेड द थर्ड आंग्लो मैसूर वार हू इज कॉल्ड as the architect of india's foreign policy jawaharlal nehru is called the architect of indian foreign policy the chipko movement is a successful movement how due to this movement the permission given to cut the trees was withdrawn mention any two hill stations of himachal नैनीताल दार्जिलिंग मसूरी शिमला ड्रजिंग इज एसेंशियल इन कोलकाता पोर्ट वाई कोलकाता पोर्ट सफर्स फ्रॉम सिल्टिंग टू क्लियर द सिल्ट इट इज रिक्वायर्ड मेंशन द एडवांटेजेस ऑफ डिसेंट्रलाइजेशन डिसेंट्रलाइजेशन रेड्यूस वेरियस काइंड ऑफ एक्सप्लोटेशन upholds human independence and dignity nurtures human values like compassion and cooperation who issues the national saving certificate post office third main answer the following questions in 2 to 4 sentences or points each how did the bedas of halagali revolt against the british In 1857 CE the British banned the usage of weapons the bedas who always kept guns as part of customs they were good hunters they rebelled against the british when they were asked to surrender their firearms the bedas of manturu bodani alagundi and others joined halagali bedas the british army entered halagali village to suppress the rebellion they suppressed the bedas in an inhuman way all the rebels were hanged till death how was goa liberated from the portuguese 
a sustained movement was held to protest against the portuguese occupation of goa though they were ordered to vacate goa portuguese brought more army from africa and europe tried to consolidate their power over goa satyagrahis from all over india entered goa and declared the exit of portuguese from goa the indian military entered goa and took over its administration goa had remained a union territory till 1987 later became a state which factors have influenced india's foreign policy national interests geographical interests political situation economic interest military issues public opinion international situation or how is india trying to eradicate economic inequality at the global level india insisted that the developed countries should provide assistance to developing countries without any conditions this helped the poor nations to protect their self respect it tried to channel monetary help to the third world countries india as a progressive nation is trying to promote economic equality among all the countries of the world write any four differences between organized and unorganized workers the sector which is enrolled as per the law of the government and provided fixed wages facilitate within the framework of law is called organized sector the unorganized sector of work is that sector where legal provisions do not completely government this sector is guided by minimum wages act special allowances act provided fund provident fund act and many other acts in support of laborers the minimum wages in this sector usually stays below the mandatory pay fixed by the governments there is a need for registration there is no need for registration this sector follows the legal provisions of the government this sector does not follow the legal provisions of the government it is also mandatory for them to pay taxes there are no tax provisions here school hospitals industries government related services commercial banks life insurance companies military and others belong to this sector vehicle repair selling of goods like vegetable fish on head puncture repairs and others belong to this sector there is fixed time or duration for this work there is no fixed time or duration for this work how can mob violence be controlled mob violence is controllable through effective use of police military and other agencies of the government why does monsoon retreat in the early october in early october due to decrease of temperature and low pressure area is gradually replaced by high pressure over the land mass a low pressure area is developed over the bay of bengal what are the effects of coastal erosion coastal areas including trees and buildings can be washed away the roads railway lines bridges etc along the coast can be damaged coastal areas can remain flooded over a long period of time requiring resettlement of people how is life expectancy calculated availability of nutritious food excellent health and hygiene facilities clean environment mention any four financial institutions that help for self employment industrial development bank of india national bank for agriculture and rural development export and import bank small industries development bank of india fourth main answer the following questions in six sentences or points each how did the british education impact on india indians could develop modernity secularism democratic attitudes impetus was received for the local literature and languages this facilitated unity in thinking process among the educated class periodical started emerging new social and religious reformation movements emerged the thoughts of j s mill rousseau and montesquieu brought fresh thinking 
the freedom struggle that were taking place across the globe influenced the indians indians could understand and appreciate their rich tradition what were the aims of arya samaj all hindus should believe in one formless god no one is a shudra or brahmin by birth and caste based system was rejected encouragement to intercaste marriages rejection of polygamy and child marriage men and women are equal one should study vedas and other ancient sacred text and preach them or what were the contributions of sri narayana guru dharma paripalana yogam the caste differences were too much in kerala and there were many prohibitions in place in order to address this issue sri narayana guru started dharma paripalana yoga movement one caste one religion and one god for human beings was the basic idea of sri narayana guru education is the only path to achieve this he declared he built temples for the backward communities as they were denied entry into temples narayan guru and his companions started vaikam satyagraha movement the satyagraha for entry of untouchables into guruvayuru temple was a major incident what were the reasons for the failure of the revolt of 1857 it did not cover every part of india it was mainly concentrated on the issues of the rights of kings and queens rather than liberation of the country as it was not a planned mutiny there were many unexpected results the unity among the british and the disunity among the indian soldiers resulted in its failure the mutiny lacked direction and leadership the soldiers also lacked discipline discipline and organizing skills the indian soldiers lacked military strategies planning capabilities and soldiering skills the freedom fighters lacked definite aim many of the indian kings extended their loyalties to the british and did not support the freedom fighters the plundering and other crimes committed by the sipais made them to lose the faith of common people explain the relationship between india and russia india has cordial relationship with russia it had similar relationship with ussr also even though india followed non aligned policy it had good relationship with russia in the field of economics politics and other areas ussr had opposed china's invasion of india in 1962 during the goa liberation of 1961 ussr had supported india at un ussr had supported the tashkent agreement between india and pakistan in 1966 in 1971 India and USSR signed an agreement of 20 years for peace and cooperation. USSR had supported for the establishment of Bilai and Bokaro steel plants. India has taken major support from Russia to improve its industries and technology. Russia has extended its support to India's quest for permanent seat in the UN Security Council. Explain the legal measures undertaken to eradicate untouchability. the article 17 prohibits untouchability untouchability offences act in 1955 protection of civil rights act in 1976 according to this act practicing untouchability is a crime universal right to vote and participate in election reservation has been given in the field of education and employment for sc and st along with backward classes the sc and st act of 1989 has given some specific responsibility for the governments in the eradication of untouchability the erosion of soil leads to low indian agriculture justify loss of soil fertility and fall in agricultural productivity it leads to silting and floods change of the course of rivers and reduction of capacity of the reservoirs ground water level is lowered and there is decrease in soil moisture vegetation covers dries up and drought increase economy as a whole suffers a lot suffers a great setback what are the advantages of road transport for the development of agriculture and village industries roads are essential because they are very convenient to connect isolated villages 
Roads can be constructed in forests and hilly regions. They connect remote places with towns and cities, provide door-to-door -door service. They are the feeders to railways, seaports and airports. They play a very important role in tourism, trade and commerce and industries. They create employment opportunities and are most useful for defense especially in border areas which are the key features of panchayat raj system in india a three tier structure of district taluk and village panchayat with the gram sabha as foundation direct and periodic elections reservation of seats for sc st and backward classes and women provision of major financial and administrative responsibilities budget and audit requirements provision for executive or support staff and a strict procedure for dissolution or suppression of panchayats and mandatory election within 6 months of dissolution or what is the role of panchayat raj in the development of rural areas panchayat raj institutions play key role in enabling the rural people to participate in rural development they are responsible for implementing various schemes related to poverty alleviation and livelihood security besides providing public amenities they provide the rural community with basic facilities of roads drains drinking water street lights toilets school and hospital buildings market yards etc through encouragement of primary and middle school education adult education technical and vocational training and expansion of health and hygiene facility panchayats have also attempted to develop human resources the generation of employment and alleviation of poverty can be implemented effectively through panchayat raj institution the public distribution system in villages is strengthened and poor people are provided with essential food grains write the functions of banks accepting deposits from public and others lending money to public and other institutions transferring money from one place to another collecting money on checks draft bills discounting of bills hiring safe deposit lockers conducting foreign exchange transactions keeping valuables in safe custody issuing letters of credit and guarantee conducting government transactions or list out the characteristics of a successful entrepreneur creativity innovation dynamism leadership team building achievement motivation problem solving goal orientation risk taking decision making commitment self confidence answer the following questions in about 8 sentences or points each question number 34 what is the role of radicals in the freedom movement the soft stance of the moderates towards the british made unhappy group within the congress to call them as political beggars the group congressmen who criticized the soft stance of moderates are called as radicals arvind ghosh bipin chandra pal lala rajpat rai bala gangadhar tilak are the main members of this group they opposed the stance of the british who considered nominating the indian members to indian legislative assembly as an important favor tilak declared swaraj is my birthright and i shall have it attaining complete freedom was the aim of radicals they tried to organize the common people of india they attempted to organize people by employing religious celebrations too they used ganesha shiva ji durga celebrations to organize people against the british write the achievements of subhash chandra bose in the freedom movement of india he became popular as neta ji he encouraged himself in organizing the indians residing outside india he toured many cities like vienna berlin rome istanbul he founded the congress socialist party he became the president of haripur convention of indian national congress with the support of gandhi ji he quit congress and founded forward bloc he opened the british war preparation he opposed the british war preparation the british government arrested him and put him under house arrest he escaped from the house arrest and reached germany he organized the prisoners of war from india he broadcasted his speeches over azad hind radio to indians ras bihari bose had founded indian india independence league in tokyo of japan he was calling its military wing as indian national army 
Bose called for Delhi Chalo on this occasion. Subhash Chandra Bose died in aeroplane crash. Or explain the various tribal revolts in the Indian freedom struggle. The tax and forest policies implemented during the British administration were the reasons for tribal revolt. Among them, revolt of Santala, Kola, Munda are important. Halagali Beda's revolt of Karnataka is another notable revolt. The revolt of Santala tribe is considered as an important revolt in India. The people of this tribe are present in the hilly areas of Bengal, Odisha states. With the implementation of permanent zamindar system, these people became landless. The land developed by them was taken over by the zamindars. The zamindars, money lenders, and company government became the exploiters of the Santala tribe. Their peace-loving nature and civilized manner were exploited by the government. The upset Santalas met secretly and decided to loot the zamindars and the money lenders. The revolt was severe. In Bhatpur, Bharat, Rajmal areas, as a result, the tribal people killed their enemies, frightened money lenders and zamindars fled from these areas. Though the revolt of Santalas came to an end, it became an inspiration for many revolts in future. Similarly, Kola and Munda revolted against the zamindars. List out the steps taken to improve the status of women in India. Women and Child Development Department The government seeks to improve the status, health and education of the women. Many programs have been implemented to curb child marriage system, Dowry Prohibition Act. Compulsory education are important as means of empowering women. The government of Karnataka has implemented Stri Shakti program. Various cooperative formation like Stri Shakti, self-help groups, association of self-help groups have been formed. Women commissions have been established at national state level to address the various issues of women. Attempts are made to provide reservation at state and national legislature bodies. Women reservation has already been provided at the local bodies. Women reservation is also provided in government recruitments. Name the agricultural types practiced in India. Subsistence, subsistence farming, intensive farming, commercial farming, mixed farming. Plantation farming, dry farming, humid farming, irrigation farming. Draw an outline map of India and mark the following in it. Tropic of Cancer, New Manglu, River Godavari, Pakranangal Project. A. Tropic of Cancer. B. New Manglu. C. River Godavari. D. Pakranangal Project. Alternative question for visually impaired candidates only. What are the aims of multipurpose river valley projects? To provide water for irrigation, to control the floods, to generate hydroelectricity, to prevent soil erosion, to develop inland waterways and fishing, to provide recreation facilities, to provide water for domestic purposes and industries, to reclaim land for agriculture.